Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Blake Damon here and today I'm playing D.Va at Hollywood. I think I picked D.Va here because there's a lot of high ground throughout this map and D.Va's boosters make it easier for me to get to high ground faster. I see this reaper going for the Junker Queen who went around the corner. So I decided to fly over and support him. I think he could have done it alone, but it's always a good idea to secure that kill by giving him just a little bit of support. I think it's because I'm a support main that I think like this, but I think it's a good way to play as a tank as well, especially as a diva, since she has the ability to fly in and out of situations. Oh, you ate it. I wish I could say that me eating Tracer's ult was intentional. Unfortunately, no, it wasn't. I was just trying to back out without taking too much more damage, which is why I was reversing with my Matrix up. And Tracer was kind enough to throw it into the Matrix while it was up. So thanks, Tracer, for making me look good. Okay, that time I actually did want to eat the ult. I honestly didn't think I would, but I did somehow. Nice. All the ults! No, we're still winning. Yeah, I really should have just left. Both the supports had actually been eliminated. So I'm not entirely sure why the Alari thought that we were still winning. Without the supports, there's only so much a health pack can do. Meanwhile, the enemy team is doing damage and getting ult charge, and it's not going to look good for us. I don't have. Yeah, I thought this would end this way. I didn't really see us winning this team fight. The Genji and the Tracer were all over us. And because of that, we were fragged and staggering. Yeah, I gotta say the enemy team did a good job capturing that first point. They did a good job and they deserve it. Especially the Tracer and Genji. Up here. Yeah, the Junker Queen is going up. Yeah, I'm trying. Uh. Behind Tracer. Kill the two of us, Life Fever and me. It looks like the Tracer is continuing to do a very good job by eliminating my supports. It is a very annoying, but it is a tried and tested way of winning the game. So, doing well, enemy Tracer, and I hate you. Keep up the good work.
that Life Weaver's Life Crypt came in just in time. I had 16 health left. Excellent reflexes. Thank you, Life Weaver. A good thing to do if you have a teammate coming back to cover is to move forward in front of them until they're safe. Like what I did with that Reaper who was fading back. I moved forward to go in front of him so he was shielded and safe in case his fade ran out. Just another way of supporting your teammates as a tank. I think had we killed him that little bit faster, we would have got that team kill. At the same time, we oh, do God. like a staggered tank. So, hmm, win-win, I guess. Where is he? It's gone. It, it's gone. Unfortunately, I missed eating that ult. I feel like had I held down the matrix button faster, I feel like I would have been able to get it because she was aiming at my general direction. Unfortunately, I was too slow, but I'll know for next time. The great thing is that no one died from her ult, so that's great. We love a silver lining. Ah, where are you? Right now I'm hiding behind cover because my full team isn't here. Also, I'm about to get my ult, so I'm just waiting for that to charge up before I commit. I dare you! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Can you s oh. Hey! <laughs> it's gotta be when I ate the two. Oh no. No, you killed two, yeah. Three! No, oh, and you killed one. Uh -huh. Yeah, I the combo. With Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Big from. <laughs> <laughs> like, nah, you don't get to go away. You, yeah. you enjoy this. You